every single day I'm gonna make something great the theme of that basket full of stuff was only ten dollars so y'all know me I had to see what was in it I was curious so I bought the ten dollar bag basket you get the ten dollar basket and they give you all of these trash little not trash bags but these little white bags to take your stuff out to the basket out to the car and put all your stuff in the bag so in my basket i had all of these flags um <clears throat> they come from target they come from target they were over in targets spots playground they were dollar there's some kind of um flag two packs so you get two flags in here and they're black and white stripes so something like that i'm not sure if i'll be able to sell them i will look them up research it if not i will just be donating that you know to goodwill or something like that here this was in my thing you can never have too much tissue and this normally would have been four dollars and 49 cents it's a little you know the boxes are beat up but i'm sure the tissue is just great so we got that then this was in there it's a star wars light up poster that you do it yourself to get to color it and stuff does it actually light up well it's not lighting up i guess the swords light up so that's a cool little project for kingston to do and now this is the table y'all let me just give y'all an overview excuse the background because i'm working on my poshmark and ebay stuff <clears throat> so this is the overview of the table i try to lay everything out so let's just go through it so here we got this says um double double toil and trouble and i got one two three of those were in the basket and these are normally three dollars so i think this is like something that i probably got all these flags i gotta move out the way i'm like stepping on i think this is something that um <clears throat> i haven't did any research on any of these things some of the stuff i'm just not finding out about like when i was putting this stuff in my car i didn't even have time to look at each piece i was just dumping it in the bags but um like this item right here these three items i think this is something that i probably should be able to resell on ebay um so we shall see again like i said when i do my research if it looks like something that won't sell or that wouldn't be worth my time i will just donate it so we got that that don't look like nothing i would keep so yeah i got that and then we got some hair clips which i definitely will be keeping those for vivica so you see how that works and um, the price on these, I don't know how much these would have been. Y'all can't believe all this stuff was $10. And then, also got a Candy Crush, the Candy Crush Adult Coloring Book. And the kids have at it. Or maybe, it looks like some pretty fun stuff to color. So we might just keep it. It just depends. And then we got some uh, ribbon. And this is a really pretty uh, color. But it doesn't look like nothing that I need in my stash. So it'll probably be something that I sell. I'm not for sure. And it would have been $2.99 if I would have bought it at Target. <clears throat> then we got this posted private property sign. Um, it has a little tear in it. So there's definitely nothing I can sell. I don't need to post it nowhere around my house. So I'll just donate it. And it might actually make it to the trash. Who knows? It's the cool looking black tape dispenser. That was $8.99. But it's missing the little um, thing that you put inside the tape. So I don't know. That's probably something you can find. So I don't know if it's something I could sell. Um, by the weight of it, I probably would just donate it. We got some ice packs. So I will keep these. You never have too many ice packs when you got kids. And we have this Kansas Chief. What is it? It said it was a Kansas City Chiefs. It's a poster hunt. Seventeen. So I don't know. We'll look that up. If it's something sellable, we'll sell it. If not. If the boys want it, they can put it in their room. I don't know if they will or not. I don't know nothing about that. I think that's football, right? Uh, photo holders. And I got like, how many is it? Five, I think. Yeah, five of them were in the basket. This is definitely something that I can resell, I think. Great for college students. So we shall see what the luck is on that. Um, I might keep one to put in my kitchen. I don't know. But if I did, I'd probably paint it. I'm not sure. But anyway, I have a... A curtain panel. I actually, y'all, look at this. This thing was $24.99. And I'm pretty sure that I probably more than likely can sell this on eBay and definitely make back my $10 that I spent on everything that you see on this table. So, this is really cute though. Got some party invitations. 
your invited party invitations. I think this is, isn't that the Target brand? I'm pretty sure it is. So, yeah, you know, I could sell these for just like a couple of bucks, like a dollar or something. Like, it's no no big deal. Because I could pay $10 for everything. Then we got these cute little, you're invited, um, My Little Pony um, invitations. Then we got some kind of football word scrabble. So, I guess this would be perfect for Super Bowl. For people that want to play like Super Bowl games. So, we got that. And then we got something, fill in the blanks. I'm probably a game that you play at birthday parties, I'm sure. I don't know, but we'll see. Then we got some stickers. I'll just give those to Vivica. I'll put those in her Valentine's Day basket. They're really cute. And then, y'all, I'm really clueless as to what this is. Whatever it was, it was $2.19. I don't know. Somebody tell me, what did he use this for? I don't know. It must be some man tool because I have no idea. And then we got some flags here. Got two flags. I definitely should keep those. I can use those for 4th of July decorations or something. So that's something that we'll put in the keep pile. And here is travel travel pillowcase protector. So yeah, that's pretty cool. I don't need that. So yeah, that'll go in the sale pile. Um, then this, I'm not sure what this is, y'all. It's something that you hang on the wall. I don't know if it's supposed to be two of these and one of these, but whatever it was, it was five dollars and it came from Walmart. And I can't really read what it is because the sticker's in the way. So, I mean, I figured like maybe you can hang it on a wall and like hang a hanging plant from it. I don't know, we'll see about that one. And then this right here will go straight to my trunk. This is great for the icy, snowy days, although we don't get that much snow in ice in Texas, but when we do. We don't know how to act. So we got this little ice scraper with a little brush thingy on the other end. It's in perfect condition. And it was $6.99. Then we got this goodie brand headband. Head wrap or something. Yep. That's cute. Then what is this? Some kind of stereo connector. We got baby shower games. We got pool games. I'm going to try to speed it up. I don't want this video to get too long. We got some floral picks and wreaths right here. More little picks. Look like it got broken though. And then this is cute. These are some starry lights in red. Perfect for Valentine's Day. Yes. Then I got this wreath. But it's like tangled up with this like scarf. So I have to like detangle this scarf off of it. The little, this little I think it's a scarf or handkerchief or something that's gotten tangled up in it. So I got to detangle it. But this is perfect for the fall. Then we got a little miniature um, stapler. Like you could put on your backpack or something like that. Then we got the same little uh, similar type thing. Something, a little miniature um, calculator. Something you can clip onto your backpack or put in your backpack. Then we have a calendar that's good for six more months because it ends to June 2019. I did look at this when I was sitting it out on the table. It's really cute, y'all. So, it's pretty colors. Really pretty. Then, y'all, this thing right here is so heavy. So, <clears throat> when I got the bag and I was taking it out, when I got the, bought the basket and I was putting this in the bag, this thing is super heavy. And I'm like, what is it, y'all? I didn't know what it was. So, I finally read the back and basically well not basically it's a pillar a candle a pillar candle holder so it's kind of cute it's not like it doesn't really match anything in my home i don't think but um it's too heavy to sell so i either try to put it to use i could always spray paint it and then if i don't find no use for it i'll just donate it then right here we have a pile of um party like tablecloths this one is trolls this one had been open so it has a little a few little nicks here and there but it looks like to be in good condition so um you know it's got i don't know if that's a tear or something so these i probably just donate these or i'll just put them in my craft area and these are great for when um the kids are doing art projects especially when they're dealing with paint like when we did pumpkins and stuff like that and instead of trying to put down a whole bunch of uh, trash bags or plastic bags we can just use these because it's a cover up the whole table or something like that so those are coming handy so i have three of those 
We got a Paw Patrol one and a Mickey Mouse one. And the Mickey Mouse one does does have a rip in it. So these can come in handy. I'm not gonna, probably not going to try to resell them because they're not like in the best condition. But we can use these for our projects. Then over here, I believe this is something for my grillers out there. Like to clean your grill or something. Oh yeah, there you go. Barbecue grill brush. So yeah. Um, then this is a removable ankle guard. I don't know. Something that has to do with sports. Something that I will see if it's resellable because it looks like it's a Puma brand. So it might have some value to it. We shall see. Three of these little um, beer bottle um, carriers. You, but if you got, you could put, I say, I say you could put, um, you could put sodas in there too if you wanted to, if you don't drink beer. So I'll probably keep one and then the rest I'll donate and or sell i'll probably just keep the one that says sunday fun day and this would be cool for me to put like drinks in or whatever for me and the kids when we go to the park and hang out sometimes in the summertime we hang out on sundays so yeah i'll put a can of soda in there some you know some snacks or something so i'll either keep both of the sunday fun days and get rid of that one something like that another uh photo holder um uh, cross your fingers another one of those that's I'm, that's cute i kind of like that one and then right here, this is um, a dish dish drying. I guess it goes in your dishwasher and you put like your silverware in, I think. You know, but you know what? You could attach some magnets to the back of this and you could put this on the side of your refrigerator hole, like your pens and pencils or something. You could get creative with that, so we'll see. And this is a little um, art piece, like for your bathroom or somewhere in your house where you have like a beach theme going on. It's really cute. Really, really cute. I like that. And then right here we have this a mud lark. I think that's how you say it. Some kind of glass glass dish. Um, I can keep this in my little gift my gift box. So when some unexpected birthday come up or teacher appreciation week, this is something that I could gift along with something else, you know. So here we got some other kind of micro microfiber spray mop refills another little some kind of guard this is like shin guard i think and yep circular needle i guess it's for knitting yeah but i have no idea what this is i'm still lost for words because it says natural grade soap stone i don't know what that is y'all let me know in the comment section down below explain this to me please i don't know then we have a box of kleenex boxes all beat up but i'm sure the kleenex is fine then y'all i i sure can't do nothing with these little doggy uh disposable diapers but <laughs> that is funny i'll definitely be donating those i'll two little candles and they're in my favorite color perfect for valentine's day it's a shade of it's kind of purplish pink fuchsia maybe so we got those four cute bags pretty colors y'all are so basically i already got my bags for teacher appreciation week then I got some more stuff for the grill. This is cool. So you know what? Yep. Um, I can get this to one of my to an uncle or one of my cousins or somebody that likes to grill. Like I could put this with this and then get like an apron or something or whatever. Or give them this for barbecue. And look, and we got a cute little gift. Father's Day or something. Like I don't know. Um, what is this? Is a monogram kitchen tile, so it has a letter B on it. I could give it to Braylon. Patrol book. We'll just get that to Donovan. And then we got a ceramic lobster design round. What is that? I don't even know what that is. Some kind of plate. That's what it looks like. It's really nice and heavy too. Hmm, this is cute. It's a nice little maroon base. Currently, this has actually been sitting on my table. I just gotta get like some flowers or something for it. And this is um this is from Target. And then we got a can cooler, the Seattle Supersonics. I probably can sell that. Then we got another one that says this is what freedom tastes like. It's another can cooler. Then we got some uh what is these? These are decorative drapes drapery rings we got some food picks right here put this one in my bathroom then we got this really cute um tumbler you know kind of like for your patio or something this is sophia the first or something i think it's like you paint it and then maybe you put a picture of your face in there 
Yeah, I think that's what you do with that. Queen stuff or whatever. So these are note cards with envelopes. And then I got some of their drawer pulls. So I think I got three of them. Two of them match. One of them don't go. But it's one of those things like you can list it. And hey, somebody might be out there just looking for one more, you know. Or they could just be doing a nightstand and they only need two, you know. So we'll see. Then we got some foil scrapbook paper. 24 sheets. Really pretty colors. And this this was over in Target's um, Dollar Spot area too. And then we got a water bottle that I can't do anything with because it doesn't have a top to it. It's Snow Buddies uh, made make fast easy snow sculptures. So that's pretty cool. This was in there that says dad. It's a dad sign. You need some batteries. And then we got uh, another stereo connector. So I ended up with two of these. And then this, I have no idea what this is. And hooks, damage free hanging. Oh, something's like to hang your cords on, like maybe behind your TV or by your desk or something. So we got that. Texas Longhorns to do list. Cool. This have a magnet on it. Boom. Put it on the refrigerator. Damage though. See that? I just noticed that. This is damage. This is in there also. Again. Um, I don't know if all the pieces in there. The box has uh, has been open. Um so I don't know. It might be something that I just just straight take to the donate. No, I hope you guys enjoyed that video. Um I thought that some of those items were really cool considering everything that was in that basket was only ten dollars um, I did pick out a few things that I feel like was just like my absolute favorite things that I'm definitely already gonna know that how I'm gonna use it and gonna be able to use it um, a lot of those items I will be donated a lot of them I will be selling but I'm gonna show you things that I already know what I'm gonna do with was this thing right here this is a vase it normally was $14.99 that's a nice little maroon color. Um, I'm going to put some flowers in here or some like a, some of those uh, floral sticks. And this is going to sit in the center of my dining room table. The beautiful $5 table that Joan found for me and bought for me. She's so sweet, baby girl. And I got I got some, I got something for you. I need to get it to you. But anyway, so I got that. And if y'all don't know who Joan is, as a, a, a fellow YouTuber on here that's become my buddy. She's a good friend of mine. Um, you have to check out her channel. I'll put her information in the description box down below. If I forget, just leave me a comment and let me know that you forgot. Because sometimes I say I'm going to put stuff in the description box and I forget. But you guys are really good about reminding me. And then this vase is another vase that I like. And this one too would have been $14.99. And this one's going to go in my bathroom. Put them in there and I'm going to make me a little floor arrangement with them. You know. And it's going to go in my bathroom. Starry Lights. I'm going to be using these in my uh, kitchen for my Valentine's Day decor. And I'm going to pop these in the freezer so I can have these on standby for whenever one of my children's need children's need an ice pack. And these would have been $3.99 a piece. And they're really nice. These bags. I thought these bags were really cool. You, I got one, four of them. And I'm going to be using these probably for Valentine's Day or Teacher Appreciation, teacher appreciation Week. It's a picture holder. And it's the cross fingers, like, ooh, come on, come on, 100 day, come on, I mean, 100 day, 100k, I need 100,000 subscribers, yes, let's go, thank you, praise Jesus, you know what I'm saying, got my fingers crossed, but you know what I'm saying, if you got faith, you don't need to cross your fingers, but I still thought it was cute, so like I said, I hope you guys enjoyed this video, if you want to see more videos like this, um, let me know in the comment section down below, and let me also know what you think was the best thing out of everything that you've seen in the basket let me know what you think was the best thing and if you thought purchasing the basket for ten dollars was a good idea or no and make sure you're subscribed to the channel if you're not already subscribed if you are thank you so much for being part of the my Shalina gang the pink loves until next time stay you stay beautiful and stay unique bye guys